Hey guys, Jim Edwards here. Hope you're having a great day. And along with me, I have Mr. Stu Smith. Welcome, Stu. Hello, everybody. I don't know if I point this way or if I point that way, which I just go like this. Guys, we are starting a new era in the in the world of the, the Jim Edwards Method Premium. And the reason that we're going live in the group today is because you have one more day to sign up to join the Jim Edwards Method Premium and get in on all the goodness that we have for you. And so we figured we'd give you a preview of what was going on. And another reason why that I ha have Stu here is you guys may or may not know, but Stu and I for the last, I think two and a half years, have yep. operated a uh, membership called the DIY Media Marketing Academy that was focused on how to do it yourself when it comes to all things media marketing, meaning our philosophy was all of us are a media company that sells X. So you're a media company that sells real estate, you're a media company that sells books, you're a media company that sells software. And then Stu uh, and I were talking right after I got after back from Funnel Hacking Live and I said, you know what, man, it just feels like we're too divided. So let's have you come join in the Jim Edwards Method Premium become the, what did we decide your title is, Stu? The LDT officer, which stands for Let's Do This Officer. Because that's, that's right. the main thing. That's the problem is we got to show people how to do this. Exactly. And then I'm going to do it. And we're going to talk about some of the things that, uh, some of the hiccups that maybe you can avoid uh, with, uh, you know, just us doing it with you. Exactly. So we're going to take the get it done attitude from DIY Media Marketing Academy and we're going to combine it with the um, with all the wizards and the tools and the training and the vault. And we're at, you're also actually getting everybody using the Jim Edwards Method Premium. You're getting the whole vault from DIY Media Marketing Academy, too. So we're just putting everything together. And so what we wanted to talk about today we're going to be doing lessons now differently. We're going to have weekly video lessons, kind of like a podcast. And then we're also going to have a big monthly lesson as well. Stu and I are going to jump on every Tuesday and do some training. We wanted you guys to see um, what this was all about. And so we're just, we're just going to go. So this is, this is the first training. And so this month we're going to be focusing on the most important thing you can do in your business, which is to create content every single day, put some sort of value out there into the universe. And Stu, you give everybody the, the two minute background on you, your business, what you do, and sure. how you market your business. Because if anybody was doing content daily, it's you. Oh yeah, I do content daily all the time, whether that's an article I write, or it's a meme that I post on social media, or just a Q&A you know, ask a question and get answers, or I take questions and give answers, right? That's a real three quick, easy ways to get content done. Uh, but I, I sell books for a living. I'm a writer by trade, a fitness writer. I tend to focus on the military, law enforcement, and firefighter fitness. You know, as a Navy veteran, um, you know, I have that experience of my journey. And then I've been training people for decades on the same process of getting to and through various challenging training programs in the military, law enforcement, and firefighter sector. So that's what I have been doing. I've been Stu's being about, modest. About Stu graduated years. from the Naval Academy. He's a former Navy SEAL. He spent eight years as a Navy SEAL. He trains all the guys coming out of the Naval Academy who go to the um, who go to BUDS and has the best performance rate of his students graduating from BUDS than any other trainer in the known universe. And Navy <laughs> actually copies him and his training. <laughs> Stu sells tons and tons of books and has been for 20 years and has trained Army Rangers, SEALs, Green Berets, FBI agents, anybody who wants to do anything cool in the military, spec ops and, and um, uh, police, firefighter, Stu trains him. He's a guy that trains me and helped me from going to be fat and 40 to being 50 and fabulous. <laughs> and, uh, so, but yeah, that's, that's what I do. I, I, I write books and articles and it pulls people into my website. And like Jim went down that funnel and uh, became a member of my you know, fitness training program that is a membership site as well. So um, it is all about daily content. 
and exactly. I do it on social media. I do it in articles on my blog. I do it in emails to my list. Um, but then, you know, also membership sites too, they need content. Right. And that's really what, you know, motivates me a lot to, to get content out there, especially when they're paid members of a newsletter right. you know, versus just spamming them with a whole bunch of news. Exactly. Yeah. So we're all about hacks and getting stuff done, but having good stuff done. And so there's really three things you need to remember when you want to create content because people get all flipped out. They're like, oh, Jim, I don't have chickens, so I can't let chickens out every day. Uh, you know, doing the chickens with Jim videos or, you know, I'm not good at making coffee, Jim, so I can't do coffee with Jim. Guys, it's real simple and you can make it really complicated if you want to, but we also have a ton of tools and, and things to help you get this done. But you need to remember the letters MTV, okay? And really, MTV comes down to meme, text, or video, all right? Meme tip or video. And it's meme tip or video. And basically, it comes down to if you want to post content daily, you need to think in terms of posting a graphic, posting some text, or posting a video. Now, we have a ton of scripts um, we have a ton of wizards in the Jim Edwards Method Premium to help you to do this. And we're going to demo a couple here in a minute. But the key is you need to set aside time every single day in order to get yourself into the habit of creating content every single day. And um, Jeff Herring and I teach this in Automatic Marketing Wizard, but it's, it's something that you have to do every single day because if you create content on a daily basis, then it's almost like you have currency. You have stuff to share. You have stuff to turn into eBooks. You have stuff to, to put out on Facebook, to put on LinkedIn, to put on your blog, to put on all the different places that you want to post content. And you've got to get in the habit of doing it every single day. And the most basic type of, of content that you can create is a meme. Um, if nothing else, Every day, you could be posting and sharing a meme. That's number one. Number two, as far as giving tips, Stu just gave you the ultimate tip, especially if you don't have a big following on social media. You go into groups and you answer questions, you're going to build a following. Every day, you can answer a question. You can do it with text. You can do it with a video. You can do it with an in info uh, graphic. You can answer a question. And my whole business has basically been built on answering questions. And I know Same. yours has too. Yep. Absolutely. In fact, so, most of my articles I write, and I have actually over a thousand articles I've written on military.com over the last 20 years. Over half of those are me answering a fitness question. Exactly. Yeah. So we're actually going to be doing something cool. Stu and I, um, we give credit where credit was, is due. Um, my buddy, Samantha Brown, is the one who told us about this tool called SpeakPipe that we're going to sign up for. And we're going to set it up so that you guys can literally, through your computer, ask us a question verbally and we'll be able to play it and answer your question just like a, a talk radio show. It's going to be super, super cool. We're going to get that set up this week. And so you guys uh, in the Jim Edwards Method Premium will be able to use that as well. And I think we'll probably set that up for the podcast as well. Um, so, so anyway, just, just to introduce, and in the, in the webinar next week, we're going to go a lot more in depth and we're going to um, have a checklist for you and some other stuff as far as being able to do stuff. Because in, um, in DIY, we actually came up with a checklist of what you could be doing on a daily. Didn't we come up with a checklist? Yep. Yeah, okay, yeah. I, <laughs> that was a I leading thing. Um, yes. And um, we're actually going to be going over that checklist next week on the live webinar and showing you which wizards go with which on the checklist. So it's going to make it really cool. <laughs> He's like, Oh, this is look. My, my clipboard. That's right. I put it on my clipboard cause it, it's a good checklist. Trying to think of stuff the, that, yeah, you got, if you're trying to think of things to do, you're like, Oh yeah, I'll do something on YouTube today. Exactly. So, um, we had some questions and stuff that, that we said we wanted to address real quick. Didn't we Stu? Yes. So why is it important to do daily uh, content? I think we've kind of answered that. Well, I'll give you a brainer, but give me the top one or two reasons why it's so important. Number one, it keeps you on people's radar. 
Yes. And the big thing with social media and the way people's minds are now, it, it's, a, it's a feed mentality. Used to be, you know, back in the day, you could publish an article a week and you were a rock star. People would look for right. your article and sign up for your list. Now it's, it's that feed, just thinking about Facebook, everything just going by. It's this endless parade of, of info. So instead of publishing a giant 2,000 word article, you publish a 200 word tip, you publish a meme, you publish a little two, three, four minute video that keeps you on people's radar. That's really what content marketing is all about. It, at, a, at the end, content marketing is about staying on people's radar, about staying relative or relevant. Yeah. And, and you know what it also does is it, it exactly, it keeps you, um, it keeps you relevant. Yeah. Right. It shows, because it, because I've, I've been in this business for over 20 years now, right? There are a lot more younger people that are doing this business, you know, than I am. Young right? punks. Yeah. And, you know, I'm the old guy now. Yeah, there's a right. few, few guys older than me. But, you know, at the same time, I am the older guy and I have to stay relevant, right? And that means I have to keep my mind open daily content providing as well as evolving with how – these kids these days are communicating exactly that's with social media well and Stu, Stu's kicking ass on instagram and on youtube too you're up to like what thirty thousand followers on instagram yeah and i think i hit it 40 this week for excuse me yeah i've only got three thousand um right. and then on youtube you're got over thirty thousand right twenty three thousand so. something 20, like that twenty something yeah okay a lot yeah so there's an old school saying of publish or perish. That's really what this comes down to. You got to put the content up there every single day or you're going to have a problem. So. Uh-oh. You're going to have a real problem if you don't publish. Um, so that's really the biggest reason why. You, plus, the other thing is if you're publishing content every single day, it keeps your mind in the game and it helps you to make uh, distinctions. That's the other thing. If you're constantly answering questions, you're constantly got your mind in the game, then you've got your eye out for what's going on. And you, that's how you can be a leader because you, you're, you become a thought leader of your tribe. Yes. Yeah. For okay. me, I write about training. So I should be training every day. And that's what I do. I train people every day for these jobs and I see problems. I see solutions. I, you know, have to be thinking all the time, you know, with these individuals and, you know, one individual having an issue now sent, through social media or through, you know, other means, you know, helps, you know, another, you know, 50,000 people with that same problem. Right. right. So exactly. Yeah. Okay. So that's why daily content's important. Yes. Yeah. How about, um, you got any cool wizards that could help us with daily content? What? Of course yeah. I have daily wizards that would help us with content. Well, remember a lot of these guys are DIY media marketing guys and they don't have no idea what a wizard is. Oh, that's true. Okay. Yeah. That's true. So let me share with you something real quick when we're talking about creating content and I want to share with you uh, a concept that you just need to understand. Oh, look at this. Oh, looky, looky at the magic whiteboard. Here's the thing you got to understand. There's three parts to creating and actually marketing with content, all right? And most people get caught up in just one of them. Okay, first of all, you gotta come up with an idea for the content that you're going to create. And sometimes that's super easy, sometimes that's really hard. And the reason for that is depends on a lot of things, your mood, your how much work you got going on, all kinds of stuff going on. So we actually have a ton of wizards for coming up with ideas. So we can make it, you'll, you jump in and start using, I using the wizards for the ideas and you'll have more ideas than you know what to do with. All right. That is true. Then there's the actual creation of the content. Now that might be text. It might be you getting on camera on your phone or it might be memes, which, or it might be other stuff too, but ultimately it's video, it's text. It's a graphic. And again, we have wizards for that as well. Now, here's the key. Once you create that content, you've got to distribute the content. And that's where a lot of people fall down. They think, oh, okay, well, I created some content and I threw it up on uh, Facebook, so I'm done. Or I threw it up on Instagram and I'm done. Distribution comes down to a checklist. 
So the cool thing is that we're actually have developed wizards. If I can spell wizard. We develop wizards that are checklists. So they create interactive checklists for you to actually um, distribute your content. And one of our wizards helped uh, Sarah, one of our members, to actually have a massive five weeks relative to her business. She was able to massively build her list for her. She brought in 90 new people in five weeks. Now that may sound like a lot to some people. It may not sound like a lot to other people, but for Sarah, it is amazing. She is doing it and she's doing her content every single day and she'll be able to build from there. So that's the big thing to understand is that we have tools to literally help you come up with unlimited ideas. We have tools to help you create content and we have tools to help you distribute your content. And that's, that's important to understand. So let's come over here to the Jim Edwards Method Premium and I'm gonna show you the easiest way to be able to create content and that is with a meme. I wanna demo you guys, for you guys the meme wizard because i love this one um like i said when you, when we talk about a lot of the stuff that we did in diy media marketing academy it was finding the easy button to do things whether right. that was to write a book get it on amazon uh come up with a podcast here is a fun one these right. are just fun to do this is yeah. fun to do yeah and so i'm gonna do we want to do one for do we want to do an example or do we want to fill one out like for us just for fun what do you want to do? You tell Let's me. do one. Let's do one for okay. whatever, our business. Okay. So uh, let's do one for writing a book. All right. All right. Or we'll call it writing a book. All right. And so our target audience is what, a business owner? Sure. Okay. Well, I mean, some I could say author, but I mean, it's an, uh, let's say entrepreneur. Yeah. There you go. Are you looking at your phone? No, I'm sitting there looking at you. Um, <laughs> hype. You're distracting me. <laughs> <coughs> What's something your audience hates writing for hours? Yeah. What is it they want to, what's an, what's a result our audience wants to achieve? Um, your own original book. Have your own original book. Have your own book. How about that? Yeah. Keep it short. All right. What's a mistake your audience wants to, uh, is making or wants to avoid? So um, spending weeks writing. Uh, who's our audience? Um, what, traditional publisher? Oh, the enemy? Yeah, yeah. traditional publisher. Time. Yeah, that's true. Time is we'll it. just do traditional publisher and traditional yeah. publishers. Right. All right, boom. So we may come back. So how long did that take? A minute and a half, two minutes, if that? Yeah. yeah. We hadn't even been drinking yet. <laughs> so here we go. Um, now what this does is this creates text. And I'm going to go up and change this. Have your own book. It's write your own book. Look, go to the very top too, by the way. What? Write, write you book. See that? Might come oh. screwy. Yeah, well, that was, yeah. <laughs> okay. That's what distracted me earlier. Yeah, right. <laughs> anyway, all right. Oh, you hate writing for hours? I've never heard that feeling before. Go on. So we've got like 200 of these in here. So watch this. This is pretty cool. Oh, I'll show you an example. I love that. Okay, we click the copy button and then we click on here. This takes us over to a service called Image Flip. And Image Flip, we've got it set. So these particular um, memes, each one of these that we know, this is based on a proven meme text blueprint, okay, text um, swipe file. So we know that for this kind of thing, we want the Willy Wonka looking thing. Right. So basically, we just come over here, we paste it, boom, and uh, I actually pay the $2 a month to belong to them so I can remove the, the image flip watermark. Huh. Oh, you hate writing for hours? Never heard that feeling before. Go on. So there's a cool <laughs> meme. Um, yeah. So here's, oh, you're, sp you're spending weeks writing? Tell me how great that's going. I like that. Let's see what that one looks like. 
Uh, that's still a, a Wonka one, but that's okay. Um, so let's do another one. Writing your book, it's kind of a big deal. We know who uh, that is. Yeah. That's your boy, Ron <laughs> Burgundy. So, and, and here's the thing. We, that's a fun one. Yeah. Like so, I mean, if I'm selling something that has to do with writing a book, a wizard for that, um, a template, a service, anything like that. We can use these memes. So let's scroll down here and it's, uh... <laughs> here you go. Mama always said writing a book was kind of like a fart. No, box of chocolates. No. Nah. <laughs> if you have to force it, it's probably crap. Hmm. So. Did he say that? I don't think he said that. Yeah, that's but, a good one though. That um, is pretty funny. So, writing your book, expectation, reality. Oh. Um, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> so we can actually this one. Yeah, that's a really good one. And uh, if you pay for the thing, if you pay the two dollars. We get a third block. You can, you can get more text in there. But that's actually pretty good. I yeah. like that. One. I like that. Oh, so yeah. anyway, that's the meme wizard. We've got tons of them in here. I mean, I, I, I think I've got a couple hundred. Um, so... Anyway, there's a ton of them in here. Um, so some of them, I, I love this Ermager. Those are really funny. Have you ever seen the Ermager yeah. one? Ermager. Yeah, we got we to gotta do that one. This is, this is so politically incorrect, um, but it's awesome. Ermager, I want to write my own book. Dude, that is priceless. Um, so anyway, it's fun. And uh, that's just one of the, the wizards that you have access to. And, and again, we're going to be going over the checklist uh, on the live webinar next week. But I mean, there's so many of them. People say, well, there's only a few. No, there's no, a there's many. Hey, what about the ones with the entrepreneur? I know we use that as a buzzword earlier. Is it got some entrepreneurial ones in there? Uh, here you go. Every entrepreneur is just a ninja with a keyboard. Right. It's not bad. And I would, you know, I would change this. That's really neat. Every entrepreneur with a book. Oh, there you go. There you go. With their own book. It's just a ninja with a keyboard. I like that. I mean, that again, it's the whole purpose of doing the, um, doing the meme is it's a it's a it's a picture hook right a way to hook people on pinterest on uh instagram YouTube, on instagram on, also well not youtube way. but um pinterest facebook instagram uh linkedin you can do it on youtube as well you can use it as your cover shot for your that video, is true right? that is true that's true absolutely yeah Good thinking Stu. yeah um, but it's a way, it's a picture hook. It's a way to stop people so that they'll pay attention to what you're doing. So, um, you know, that's just a, you know, that's just one of the wizards we got. Do you want to see any of the other ones we got just so people could have kind of a preview of all the different sure. stuff we got in there? All right. Let me do that real quick. So um, I don't want to, I don't want to spend forever doing that, but sure. We'll, we'll show you guys some of the other stuff we got. So let me share that screen again. I love doing memes and I, I'll do like a bunch of them all at once too and just load them up. And then Nancy gets mad at me because I got too many of them going. But um, <laughs> let's say you wanted to come up with a, a an article, right? And what's the most important part of your article, Stu? Uh, title. The, right. The title. <laughs> if, thank God he said title. <laughs> but, but the problem is, is that if you, um, 
if you have a crap title, I almost said shit title, but I didn't want to do that. But picture, if picture too. Title, yeah. Then nobody's going to read your article. You have the best article in the world and a crappy title and nobody's going to read it. So we, here's, here's a wizard that'll help you come up with a bunch of ideas for titles. Um, so I am horrible at titles. Give you an example. You just fill out four things. All right. And here are a bunch of different title ideas, you know, three home selling tips that really work, um, home selling tactics, home sellers use seven ways to succeed with, um, home selling, uh, the truth about home selling insider secrets to home selling. The cool thing is that you can, the way these work it, everywhere you see the um, shopping cart icon, you're like, Oh, I like that one. I like that one. Uh, I like that one. Uh, I like that. Look, they all get added to the little clip bin and then you can download them. So it's like you're going shopping for ideas and then you've got all these little article titles super fast. So sweet. That's a neat one. And if you, if you're having trouble coming up with an idea for a wizard, then we've got the article idea starter express wizard, the daily content idea. Oh, this is cool. Like if you don't know what to do every day for some content, you just, answer this it's like four questions and then you whack the button and it'll give you ideas for stuff you could do so with a single mom in mind answer the question you have 30 minutes to spare for recruiting purposes what do you do so this was actually recruiting for a, a work at mom work at home and you can click that what's a recruiting question so you can just keep whacking that and it'll give you new questions you can ask and it'll give you a bunch of different <clears> ideas <throat> so um if you want to write articles, if you want to write um, tips, if you want to do Facebook Live videos, all kinds of cool stuff in here. One of the ones that I love the most is, where is it? Let's go back to the main dashboard. So the, the tip wizards we have, the instant tip long version, instant tip mistakes to avoid, and instant tip single juicy tip wizard. These help you to write entire basically entitled article entire articles so let's say we were um talking about book selling mistakes for book authors you just basically go through and fill this out It'll take you i don't know 15 minutes 10 15 minutes and it writes a whole article for you and not only mm -hmm. that but it'll take care of your title oh. it takes what you write and it'll rewrite stuff and you basically just go through here, click in the blue text until it reads the way you want. And then literally you can download your tip as a text article or it'll give it to you in a Word <laughs> document. It gives you the whole article. Nice. It'll give it to you in a um, PowerPoint. So if you wanted to do it as <clears throat> a... Um, as like a power little PowerPoint show. It has it all in there for you. So you could literally just read it. Huh. So all kinds of cool stuff that this will spit out. <laughs> you. We're going to, Oh, and not only that, but it'll write the entire email for you to announce the little tip article. Um, it'll write all your mm -hmm. tweets for you so you can promote your tip article. Oh, uh, it just makes a name make for you. Yeah. yeah, it'll make a meme for you. So it's like, I got 99 problems, but book marketing ain't one. Or you can, this one works a little different because you can just keep clicking this until you like the one. See one you like. Um, nice. You know, copy it and click on where it says make a meme and it'll take you over to that one. Actually, you got to click the first one. That's a little itch in there. But It'll also uh, write your call to action with your meme to have people go check out your uh, article wherever you post it, help you make a typographic. And even if you wanted to do it as a Facebook Live and then it'll do your uh, YouTube title and description. So these literally, you can fill this thing out once and get three or four days worth of content out of it. That is incredible. Yeah, they're cool. And we're going to do more. We've got training on them. We've done training in the past, but Stu and I are going to be using these now from the standpoint of demoing them for you and then using them ourselves, showing you the results that we're getting, where we're posting and encouraging and instructing you and leading you down the path of using them daily and getting results yourself. So um, those of you who in, are in the Jim Edwards Method Premium, 
you have access to all these goodies, everything I just showed you, and just so much more. And um, you also have, let me show you, show you, show you, show you, show you, show you real quick. Um, hey, Jim, also, remember that last one I actually used to write an article for uh, military.com? Oh, yeah, recently. Remember that? Yeah, yeah, it was just a while back ago. And how did that go? Went great. They um, liked it. <laughs> so it made it past two edi editing process, yeah, stuff, you know, so it worked. Yeah, this stuff really works. I mean, this is based on the fact that I was a syndicated newspaper columnist for 10 years. And um, But anyway, you've got access to the vault. We do new training every single month. When you come in, um, you have access to the, the vault that's just got tons and tons of, of stuff in it. We add to it every single month. Um, and we're going to be adding to it a lot more now with Stu. You have access to 13 of my downloadable wizards, the tag post wizard, easy sales copy wizard, three hour Kindle book wizard, instant sales copy, instant sales video scripts, expert interview wizard, uh, the podcast interview wizard, desktop ad wizard, PPTX wizard, custom content wizard, signature speech wizard, super keyword scraper 2.0, 60 second selling machine. There's a ton in here, plus all the easy online wizards. Tons and tons of goodness for you. Uh, those that are in the Jim Edwards Method Premium, if you're not, you need to join now because the door slammed shut tonight, really, for real. Uh, last time it was closed for over 100 days, and um, we've had it closed for as long as 14 months. We, we don't open it up very often. So um, anyway, just wanted to give you guys kind of a taste of, of what we were doing, plus introduce everybody to Stu, let you know what was going on with that. He's going to be our let's do this officer, which uh, is going to come in mighty handy. Every Tuesday, we're going to be doing updates. Um, we're going to be, I think, I think moving forward, at least for a while, we're going to dive in every Tuesday, grab a wizard. We're going to use it, actually do something with it, and then um, go out and, and take action and show you actually what we're doing. So a lot of implementation stuff coming down the pipe. Yeah, so, I'm ready. I'm cool. ready. Let's do it. All right. Well, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Have a great day, and we will talk to you soon. Bye-bye, everybody.